G'day, Olivia Regano with tonight's weather. The second wave of rain is well underway and not expected to clear until Wednesday. It has, for many stations, been the coldest day so far this year and tomorrow could be colder still. Biggest overnight rainfall was 82 millimetres at Brampton Vale. Yapoon had 38 mils, Yamba 32, Rockhampton 27 millimetres and in Gladstone we had 25. Today was positively freezing with Gladstone reaching just 12 degrees and uh, similar temperatures even lower at Emerald with only 11. Many records are being challenged but we won't know until tomorrow because some temps are still rising. We'll start with the satellite loop. You can see a massive cloud band covering eastern Queensland. Widespread moderate rain has fallen over all eastern districts. And uh, even though further west we haven't got the cloud deck, it's been freezing cold there as well with southerly winds undercutting the cloud, cutting out the sun and making for very cold temperatures today. Perhaps record breaking. We'll find out soon. Today's chart, you can see the main high pressure system is now over the bite. It's being augmented by a system of lows off the southern New South Wales coast, which extend a surface trough further north. But more importantly, the upper level trough producing the rain band. On tomorrow's chart, the surface doesn't change a great deal, but the upper level trough stands up and intensifies, make, making for one more day of rain across eastern Queensland, contracting to the coast before moving offshore for Wednesday. Now the boating forecast for Capricornia Wood is southerly winds tomorrow up to 20 knots and then south southwesterlies 10 to 15 on Wednesday, about the same again for Thursday. Tomorrow's first tide will be a morning low and the rise to the afternoon high tide should be quite gentle given we're only a couple of days from first quarter moon. Capricornia district forecast, another cold and overcast day, rain mainly near the coast, Gladstone 15 degrees, Rocky only 14 Below 15 and Yapoon 14 again. Central Highlands and Caulfield, morning rain in the northeast only. 17 the top for Emerald, Claremont 16, Moranbah only 15. Looking ahead for Rockhampton, Thursday onwards should see a return to mostly sunny conditions with temperatures quickly bouncing back to average. It won't be particularly warm, just a lot less cold. Now it's back to the team. Great, thanks for that, Livio. That's all from us for this Monday. Thanks for your company. Just a reminder, you can watch a replay of our news on the 7 Plus app or catch up on our page, 7news.com.au. From all of us here, enjoy your evening. Good night.